This video microtopic demonstrates a method for burnishing platinum jewelry to remove gouges and scratches. Burnishing pushes metal back to its original location before polishing and finishing. It's better for the value of the piece as well as the engineering integrity to retain as much metal as possible. When a platinum piece is brought into your store for polishing, follow these steps for best results. First, inspect the ring and communicate any damage to the customer. Through normal wear, platinum rings acquire a natural patina and marks. Rub a highly polished tungsten carbide burnisher over the surface to smooth out the scratches. Platinum has superior malleability, so the scratches fill in or heal from the pressure of burnishing. Burnishers are made of different materials and in several sizes and shapes. These are hand burnishers. And these are rotary burnishers. After burnishing, some polishing and buffing may be required. The ring will look brand new and very little, if any, platinum will be lost in the burnishing process. This ring has been worn daily for a long period of time, resulting in all these percussion marks. It also has a cracked shank from a defective sizing solder joint. During the take-in process, the sales professional sought the bench jeweler's opinion, who inspects the ring with magnification for damage or other problems. He also checks to see if gold solder was ever used in a previous repair. The ring is taken in, and first, the shank is laser repaired, one of the safest methods for working on platinum when gems are mounted in the ring. There is a large pit inside the ring. A cylinder-shaped rotary burnisher is used to heal the pit. There are percussion marks on and between the prongs. The cone-shaped rotary burnisher proves to be the best tool to smooth out these areas. After burnishing all areas, light polishing and finishing are the last steps. The ring is like new and ready for customer pickup.